going to the third cylinder. So far, so good. And this one's having a hard time coming out. Alright, <clears throat> so what we're going to do now is uh, inspect the spark plugs to see if there's any signs of anything. That one seems to be okay. It's number one. And now we'll go into the number two. I don't want to shake it too much. I don't want the end to topple over. I want to put something under there after. That one looks all right. There we go. Alright, so this is the number three cylinder here. And then where it is. Mm, just a little bit wet. Okay. And well, it appears to be a little wet compared to the other ones. Okay, so the plugs aren't telling us much. We are going to take the timing tune off. Sitting at top dead center right now. The intake is at the 2, exhaust at the 10. I already put a screwdriver in the number one cylinder. I'll show you guys. Air fiber at top dead center. That's it. That's not going far, so we're at top dead center. Also wanted to inspect the head intake. So I go in there, I look in there. I don't see any abnormalities. Everything's nice and clean, right? So that's what I'm looking for. So this is the intake side. Everything seems to be fine. Now we'll take a look at the exhaust side. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. This is this is the one that's wet here, and I wish you could see it, but it looks like there's something wrong with the exhaust valve there, possibly bent. So that's what it looks like to me, but I don't know until we get the head popped off. Uh, this here is. A time and chain tensioner. I'm going to take this off in order to get the time and chain loose. Next up we got our timing chain guide. Yo, 
hold the wrench to here, put the socket in there. You take the pulleys off one at a time. All right, so we got the timing chain off. As you can see, we got one of the pulleys out. It was uh, pretty hard to do, but I had the ratchet on this end. I had the wrench on that end, the back here. And I just went counterclockwise and she loosened up and then now she's off. Today, so I had to do 